Hello guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to Goals Galore and welcome to another match day vlog on the channel today. This is the match day vlog for Swansea versus Wickham in round two of the Carabao Cup. Looking forward to this one to be honest. It should be a great game because Wickham has started the season, you know, they've played some really tough games. Uh, I think they've played Wrexham, Birmingham and Rotherham and one win out of their first three in the league. Uh, and very tough start for them in League One. But this will be a great test for us because Wickham, you know, there are no walkovers and uh, in the last time we played them uh, when they're in the championship of course we drew 2-2 that late comeback in the lockdown season and in the home game away at their place we won 2-0 but no Wickham very respectable side um, you know we got a, a good side tonight I expect a few uh, debuts the likes of Nelson Abbey who's signed uh, midweek and uh, the likes of uh, Biacchini is it how you pronounce it not quite sure uh, but no, um, should be a good game and hopefully we'll progress next uh, the next round, of course. The draw start as well, so by the end of the video you'll know who Swans have got in the next round. If we make it through, I really hope so. Uh, but no, we should be a, a good night and uh, some goals hopefully to celebrate. I'll go 2-1 to the Swans. I can see us conceding. Last Sunday we took our foot off the gas way too early. Uh, there is a bit of a negative feel around the place at the moment. So let's bounce back tonight. Let's get the win. Um, by the way, four home games in a row for the Swans. Um, this one, of course, Cardiff, Preston and the other cup game against Gillingham. So, yeah, test my memory there. But no, four home games in a row for us. About time we get away on the weekend, away to West Brom. But no, let me know in the comments. Has that ever happened for your club? Four home games in a row? Anyway, I'll stop waffling. Go on to enjoy the vlog. Drop a like and subscribe. Come on, the Swans. Let's go. <laughs>
Where do we start? I mean, awful, absolutely hopeless. Um, not good at all. Not good at all. I mean, half the players on the pitch were, you know, I don't think anyone on the pitch had a good game tonight, and that's a huge reason why. I don't know how we didn't score in the first half for our dominance, not taking any risks. We had so much of the ball. Um, you know, the likes of Nathan Shueyon um, had a, another bad game, uh, but I could name everyone. You know, being uh, the new winger, Bia Shani, uh, Bia Chini, however you pronounce it, not too sure yet, the new sign-in. Um, yeah, we looked okay, but once again, lacking the end product. And for someone we spent £2 million on, surely we can get, you know, someone fairly decent. I know this is only his first game, you can't really read into it too much. But likes of Abby at the back as well, wasn't impressive tonight. Um, no one was. Um, and even the striker situation still continues as a huge problem. You know, no matter uh, if it's Jerry H from last season, Liam Cullen, Zan Vapotnik this season, no matter who you put up there, they're not going to get any touches of the ball. This just, it's just not working. There's something needs to happen. Whenever Cullen's on the pitch, he seems to just drop deep and then run on because he's got the pace. But the likes of Zan Vapotnik, he plays on the last man. He's not getting involved in the game at all. Um, it's really poor. He's doing what Jerry Yates was, was doing last season. He got pelters for it online. Uh, but no, that was awful. And Wickham, much a better sign, deserved to go through in the end. And uh, well done to them. You know, a lot of our fans are clapping their goal. And uh, yeah, you know, rightly so. They, they're better than us this tonight and uh, deserve to go through. Um, I can't quite remember who they got on the next round now. I'm just re recording it as the draw has been made. So um, I, think, I think it's Aston Villa actually at home. So that would be a great game for Wickham. Best luck to them in that one and best luck for the rest of the season because um, they've had a good start to the season, haven't they? Um, playing some tough teams. Now Villa is a, a good game for them at home as well. So uh, no best luck to Wickham for the rest of the season. Really good and uh, outplayed us today. Low block, uh, made it hard for us. Couldn't break them down at all. Long ball and everyone knew their roles. For the Swans though, hopeless and... Move the ball too slow, just no one's willing to take a risk, no one's getting their body across uh, and having a, a strike at goal. I, I don't even know the stats, but I don't even think we've had more than three shots on target tonight. Awful and something needs to change, simple as that. Well, I'll stop ranting on and let you have a great evening, people. Thank you very much for watching the vlog. Hopefully, somehow you enjoyed it. Um, probably have to be a Wickham fan for that. But no, thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next very soon. If you do go to enjoy, drop a like and subscribe and I'll see you very soon, guys. Take care. Goodbye.